Hey guys, this is Sikin Near Mint Comics uh, bringing you another video of my LCS pool and uh, so a handful of eBay purchase I have made over the week uh, about two weeks ago and I'm starting to get those in a lot of people, you know, one of, a lot of guys in mainland man they, they're so cheap on, on shipping uh, they do like media mail, mail. it takes like two, like two weeks man to get to Hawaii yeah, so Oh man, I'm sorry about this shaking. I'm trying to get a right pose because I still haven't found a pod for this tablet. But anyway, here we go. Um, what you're seeing is X-Men number 25. Uh, first appearance of El Tigre. Uh, Thor number 157. Uh, you know, uh, appearance of Ragnarok. Um, you know, with the new movie, uh, with the Thor movie coming up next year. Or in the makings, I don't know when they're gonna be, uh, but I had to get it. And it's a freaking sick cover, man. The red, just everything just caught me. And talking about being caught, man, take that out. Taking that out, the poly bag, the tape got caught on that. And I'm slowly, slowly trying to pull it. And pff, yeah, game, it hurts. It hurts. But, you know. I'm sure every collector out there had done one or two of these. Um, but thank God it wasn't a key issue that I've done. Uh, but it, all this, I got it because of the, uh, if it's not first appearance, then death. If Then just overall, it's just because of the cover, um, the cover that I fell in love with as I was going through his uh, long, long, long boxes of all the Silver Age. Uh, he had a lot of... Uh, like spine rolls and I really beat up, but this is the best uh, conditions that that I could uh, pick up and that caught my eye, you know. And okay, uh, enough. Uh, go back to the comics. Uh, Captain America one twenty three, uh, first appearance of Suprema. Yeah, um, yeah. Uh, that's that. Okay, um, Avengers number fifty six, Death of Buck. Um, you know, um, just overall, it's great. I mean, got some really serious color break at the spine, but overall has a really good presentation. Uh, focus, yeah. So, yeah, it was good. I love it. Um, Fantastic Four number thirty nine. A blind man shall lead them. And the blind man happens to be Daredevil. Yeah, it's a cool cover with Doctor Doom leaning over. Yeah, I mean, it's not the good condition, probably about 4.0, um, but yeah, I had to get it. I got this all picked it up at, uh, I think, like $10 an issue uh, per book, so yeah, 50 bucks. Eh, not bad. And let me know if I made a, a good purchase or not. All right, uh, going to my uh, eBay. Uh, I, You know, these Powerpuff Girl, number one. Yes, uh, subscription cover uh, variant. Um, I bought this because my daughter loves Powerpuff, so I thought that I would get something. He, the guy said it was a 9.8 or plus, 9.8 plus. Uh, we was going back and forth, and then, so I finally decided to buy it. It's like $8 uh, with shipping, like four. Came in, it wasn't nothing near nine, not even 9.0, man. I mean, color breaks on the spines. Uh, big ass uh you know just look at that i mean it, anyway uh, it's there uh like color sp i mean color breaks and the back is just destroyed so anyway e email back and forth he said keep it so free gel pack variant pop off girl number one same thing in the back big ass creases I told him, hey, can we do a deal? Boom, another full refund, free comic book. Batman Odyssey number one, story, cover, art, everything done by Neil Adams. Um, he said this was like a 9.6, nine, 9.6 six, nine, six plus. So I got it. You know, it wasn't that expensive, but I got it. Uh, overall, I think I paid like about $8 for this. And they came in, same thing, man. You know, it came destroyed. Uh, nothing. Uh, this is more like an eight five. I mean, the corners look sharp, but I mean, I mean, 
it says because his white background is kind of hard to see, but man, spine ticks everywhere. Color break in the back, big ass creases. So emailed again. He says, you know what? Sorry for the troubles. Full refund. Free comic book. All right. Now this, I just got it because it kind of got my attention. Um, Evil Heroes, number one. This is part of uh, six covers, man. Um, but anyway, the, this story is about this freaking evil superhero just destroying everything, trying to conquer the world. So it's almost like uh, Justice League, you know, turn evil. And and this is one of the uh, the covers, uh, kind of a bit of a, like a Superman character. I love this. It's like Wonder Woman. Uh, I don't know who the artist is, but damn, man. I mean, this is... It, 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 let me know uh, if you know anybody with that uh, marker, um, the mark. It's, yeah, it was really cool. Uh, and this... It's another cover, one out of six covers that was available for this uh, series. So, yeah. So I picked that up. And also, this is highly... And Highly recommended buy for me, man. Animosity number two. I got a number one in four, I uh, no, no, three different uh, variants and the regular cover, um, all in like sick ass uh, condition. So I send it out to CGC to get graded. So hopefully, hopefully, uh, if it comes in and a nine six, anything lower than that, man, I'm, I'll be pissed. I'll be pissed. Um, but anyway, uh, when they come in, I'll do an unboxing of that. Anyway, Animosity, get it. Number one right now for regular cover, going for like 20 bucks. The last one I saw was sold for like 36 plus shipping, 40 bucks, man. All right, um, everybody's talking about Lewis and Clark, uh, you know, speculation by, you know, first appearance of Jonathan Clark. He's being uh, one of the biggest uh, protagonists in uh, DC Rebirth, uh, you know. So there's a, there's a saying that he could be the be the new character going into Teen Titans in the future. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. But anyway, um, this one, I pulled a trigger on this. I spent about, what, $45 to get this. Got it. It says near mint plus. Got it. Thinking that maybe I bring it in if it, you know, sent, sent to CGC to get graded. But um, then overall, the comic is good, um, but it's in the back. In the back corner here, man, it's scuffed. So I sent an email uh, to, you know, communicate with the seller. And he said, you know, what do you want to do? I said, you know, I like the book, man. Uh, is there anything we can work out on? And he goes, yeah, all right, what do you want? I said, you know, I just just did it. I said, you know, I was about 30 bucks. Boom, next day I get a $30 refund. So this is a $15 buy, man. All right. So how's that? So cool buy, isn't it? And I got this. I love Spider-Man. Love Tom McFarlane. Love what he does with uh, Spider-Man. I got Spider-Man 298, 299, and 300. All in a high condition. Uh, so that went into CGC to get graded. And uh, yeah, that will be part of my unboxing. All right. Um, yeah, I had to get I had to get it, man. It was, yeah, I got it for like three bucks. All right. Um, all right. Uh, need to need to pause. Hold on. All right, I'm back. Okay, sorry about that. I had to grab one thing that I forgot. All right, uh, continuing. Uh, this is some uh, CGC that I got over on eBay. Um, all right, Batman number 404. All right, uh, this is the first appearance of Modern Catgirl. And it's called The Year One Storyline Begin. So, yeah, Frank Miller's story. Um, you know, I've been commenting about you know trying to focus on key issue books and that is my little stairway to my my amazing fantasy man uh doom 143 man saw you I, I saw your video i know you have it i want it i'm gonna get it i don't know when but i will uh anyway uh go back um you know ultimate spider-man number one um another story is that there is a uh, this is an old, old, I mean, it's a flimsy, it's a flimsy uh, case. Anyway, the, 
it splits open. So I call the buyer, I call the seller, I say, hey, what's going on, man? You know, is there anything I can do about this? I'm gonna send this to CGC to get re-slabbed and you know, it's gonna cost about another, what, $56 overall to get it to slab and bring it back and he goes, he said, that's the old stuff. I said, you know what, then I want my money back. And uh, he goes, okay, what do you want to do? So he, I said, you know what, $56, is that okay? So he said, you know what, how's about 30? So I got $30 back. So yeah. Um, so that's that, you know, uh, me and my speculation about Ninjak with this wet movie, I have to get this. It's uh, uh, Ninjak number one. It's a Emerald City Comic Con uh, variant signed by Matt kind um yeah it's uh it's the cool thing is man he signed it right on the sword man pretty cool i thought that was part of the drawing but it's not but anyway it, it's yeah it's signed all right what else we got here oh ultimate spider-man number two uh nine eight yeah this is the uh the blue car hood cover variant yeah got it All right, the next one, um, what I want to show you is, oh man, where did it go? Oh, here. Yeah, so uh, my previous, uh, I got this uh, through eBay. And anyway, long story short, this is 134. Second, uh, first appearance of Tarantula and first, uh, second appearance of, of the Punisher. Now, look at the cover, right? Look at the cover. And then, Peter Parker Spectacular Spider-Man number one. And look what's, uh, man, my Captain America is, is hiding because he's, he's afraid of this huge, huge thing that I'm presenting right now. <laughs> uh, my previous video, I, I, I mentioned about my friend, we do pokers and, uh, you know, my friend, my friend Todd, I mean, it, it does get competitive. These guys get costly sometimes. Anyway, anytime he's kind of short on cash, he'll give me a, he'll give me a comic book uh, from his collection, which he stopped collecting. But this was what? Oh, Jesus Christ, man. This was like decades ago. Uh, he, he, this is the, this is the ancient slabbing. Okay. You can do it at home. Um, yeah, he, he gave it to me this way. It's been in my save ever since, uh, I believe about 20 years ago, man. <laughs> so what it is, is as you can see, that's that's the actual screws, man. Um, so the whiteboarding is, is a, it's a cardboard that you put the, okay, so this is two-sided, all right? It's a two-piece, okay? It's a two-piece. So you put the flat in one and you put the border down. And of course, in the middle, there's a mylar. There's a two sheets of mylar, okay? Because I took it off because I was very curious to see what, what the hell this was. So anyway, there's, so you put the comic book in the middle. So you, you have to kind of center it and you put the mylar, one at the bottom and, and one at the top. And you put this top case and you screw it in. And, and also there is a, like a vapor chamber like thing on both ends and still pink man after decades jesus christ i guess putting in a safe was uh was a good thing but yeah <laughs> this is the ancient slabbing before no grave maybe i should just put over here uh 10 mint but yeah this is sick man <laughs> i just wanted to share with you uh if, if you know i'm all about getting it gray getting slammed but yeah you know I, I i had to share this with you because uh it's a, it's a very funny story man i had an ancient slab in my safe and i, and I forgot to sh uh, share with you guys and and i'm very happy that i did i enjoyed it i hope you enjoyed it much as i did um but anyway um thank you for watching guys i hope you enjoyed it anyway till next time more video more videos to come okay all right thanks for watching bye bye